that's how all this got, got created. I, I didn't just do this stuff. So when you're going to ask this question, you want to have your likeness and image behind Now, maybe you're not asking questions about you. It's not your testimony to be able to answer that. Have a banner, have a pop-up on the event. That's the business real quick again. This is brand new space. That one's great for us. That one's the VIP training experience. You want to have a visual identity of what they're speaking about to connect the visual with the verbal. Does that make sense? Okay. And last but not least, I give you instruction. I teach you how to shoot it, right? Because you might not have our professional paint there to shoot it. Some of you will schedule it. We'll do professional awesome videos that you've done for Carl and that they do for Ryan too. But you can shoot this on a phone. If you've got a new iPhone or Android, all of your is pretty easy. The only advice I can give you, and this is why we do an entire training on this, the, the photo uh, videos is not this session, it's the next session. So Josh, you guys, are, we're going to go so deep into the video. You've got to make sure audio sounds good. Audio is more important than video quality. You can have the best HD 8K video in the world, if they can't hear it, they're gone in 20 seconds. If it's fuzzy and they can't really see, but they can clearly hear what they're saying, they'll listen to the whole damn thing. That's why, think of a podcast. Do you have any video on a podcast? No. As long as you have good audio, the testimonial is good. I don't care about the video if the audio is not good. I obviously do care about the video, that's what I'm saying. As long as you have a good phone and you do what? Clean your lens before you start shooting. Really important, ask them to smile before they start answering questions. There's nothing, there's nothing worse, right? There's nothing worse than like, So what did you like best about Ray Perez? Well, I love, Ray is so amazing. <laughs> right, like it, I see it all the time, right? It's like, yeah, working with Fabio was great. He has such great energy and so on. It's like, yeah, you gotta smile, right? The other thing is, do not shoot testimonial videos vertically. I know the whole world, because of Instagram, has made us start shooting everything like this, but when it comes to video, always shoot horizontally. Because we can still display it vertically, right? We can cut the, the, the thing, but on YouTube, on a computer screen, on a TV, on a projection screen, when you're about to present, and they have that little, with the two black lines, that little thing, and it looks horrible. So when you're shooting a testimony video, you can always crop it. You can't add to it. Always shoot horizontally. And always ask them to answer a complete sentence. So you don't have to do much editing. So what I liked best about working with Fabio was, that's it, there's no editing required. He answered the question within the question. Does that make sense? Because a lot of people will just start saying, well, Fabio's awesome, this and that. It's so much better to say what I like best about Fabio because it sets it up and then it creates context. If I just start talking about what I like about Fabio, there's no context and it takes the brain longer to process and make the connection. So do you see why there's so many little elements of how do we make a good video? It's not just shooting video. Our team is doing all of these details behind the scene while you just sit there and look pretty and we make it look like a rock star, right? Social media science. I like to think that I invented these. I mean, I've seen some of these somewhere else, but like, I think I own the thumbs up and the heart because I believe those are the two most recognizable symbols on the planet, right? Do you think anybody doesn't know what those, I think some kids in Kenya that live out, you know, they, 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 they still have iPhones and they know what Facebook is. Like, I'm pretty freaking sure, right? I'm pretty, they, they know what the thumbs up is. So, Here's the coolest thing. I don't know what's going on here. Is it me? Oh, is it up here? Yes, what happens is in the future, always have at least one or two backups. We should, we do. We have because it actually ends up breaking fire. And when it breaks fire, oh, it, it causes these. Okay. So, yes. Thank you. You're so, social media science, this is how I invented this. So, they, they say a picture is worth a thousand words. So then, a video must be worth a million, right? So I started thinking like, okay, so a lot of my clients, 
they don't have access to all the, um, the video production team that I have access to, right? Because it costs a lot of money to have these people around, right? Tens of thousands of dollars every month. So I'm like, what can I do to teach my clients at a super affordable, non-costly way to create social proof marketing content? So I was like, okay, if we take a photo with someone holding a sign that says that they heart the person or they thumbs up the person, then they technically give them a testimonial without having to say anything. Does that make sense? And I was like, okay, and how do I make it super compact? Well, one side has the heart, then you flip it over and it has the thumbs up. So then all I gotta do is flip the sign and we got two signs in one. And I, and I made it so it was big enough, but then it was small enough to fit in a carry-on suitcase. And we use it as a folding board. Any organized freaks like me, that's my folding board where I fold my clothes when I put it into my suitcase, and then I put it on top and I smash on my suitcase and I close on my carry-on. That's how freaking down to like science and psychology I'm rolling here. Okay? Like nobody ever thought about that thing, right? So now what happens is you start taking pictures with people holding your sign. I mean, obviously you start with people you know, but if you run out, you can have people you don't know hold your sign. And they're still giving you technically a testimony. Does that make sense? And then when we have 10 or 15 pictures, guess what we can do? We can put them in a little app that puts some music and does some motion. And we created a video in like 50 seconds. And now you have a video of people saying they thumbs up and they heart you. And you created a testimonial video with no words. Ninja, right? <laughs> right? So the social media signs are so cool because um, you, have, you don't have to say anything. I thumbs up, Ray Perez. I heart Ray Perez. That's it. It's done. Now, here's a rule. Don't ever hold your own social media sign. Don't ever hold. You can point at it. Don't hold. Okay? Because then it's like, you know, it, it's too, it's too self, self-serving, right? Okay? So, and we give you instructions and all that kind of stuff. All right, so I call this our marketing with your business card, right? I do not believe in business cards anymore. I think all of you are on the 360 site and have used your V-card, you know why. But I still have them because for marketing purposes, for those of you that are on your desk, uh, for those of you online, you can see it on the document, I still believe in exposure. So the reason I use my business cards is as a flyer, as an excuse to be a business card. I just don't pass this out to anyone. You know, if I meet you and I pass out a business card, it says I don't want to follow up. That's my joke, but it's really true. If I want to follow up with you, I'm giving you my 360 site, I'm downloading my contact information, I'm saving it, which we'll, we'll be sharing. And, and that whole process takes time to train. That's why in the 360 marketing system, we're training people how to do this, right? Because we don't have enough train today. But this goes on the desk, goes on the counter, goes in the goodie bag, goes on the table. These are your little marketing flyers, disguised as business cards. Does that make sense? Yeah. If you hand this to someone, I'm telling you right now, it's because you don't want to follow up with them. Because if not, you're going to do your 360 QR code download, text me, take a selfie. Okay, now, this business card is very simple. Image, color, name, extra title, USB, no contact information. Wait, what? Business card with no contact information? Yeah, why? Because on the back, there's a QR code and your 360 site. And it says, call, text, email, or get socially connected with Ray by visiting his 360. So it's a business card with zero contact information that actually has all my contact information because the 360 QR code goes to 360. So they have no choice but to go to my 360 because there's no phone number, there's no email, there's nothing. And when they get to my 360, I cross promote everything. Because if I just gave them a business card with a phone number and an email, that's, that's, there's, no, there's no exposure. 
The zero is still Does that make sense? This is ninja strategy as well. All right. And then there's a bunch of other designs that, that, that I'll share this with. Can I get can I get a little copy of the All right. So I'm not going to go through the whole personal brand map, but Chirp is a text messaging platform that allows to send massive text messages. Obviously, everyone knows about video conferencing and Zoom. Uh, Hootsuite is a social media aggregator where you can post to all your social medias at one time. Lately is the Ferrari of social media posting. It creates blog, it translates videos, and we have a special offer where you, where you can get there. The 365 days of social media, you can see, I've been doing this since 2020. It's already been two years that we've had this, and, and, and it's, it's been awesome. Today's Premier Experts, I already talked about our talk show, and then this is a print package which has the credibility banner, the social media signs, and the digital business cards. And the one below is a speaker print package. If you're a speaker and you physically are speaking on stages, then the bottom package is for you because it has two banners. It's got what we call our credibility cards with the QR code in the back. It's got the smaller version of the social media cards. And it's got our what we call our speaker print cards. The speaker print cards are we give people the opportunity to write notes. So it's like you're giving them something that they can use. I, I, I have this one. This one? That's it. Let me, let me pass that to you. So we can show people online. So this is a speaker print, print card. This is so awesome because this card has obviously all your information, has your credibility in the back, has a space for them to take notes. And everybody in their mind that they want to take notes, so they hold on to it because for them, it's like, I can use this for something. But you're also getting all of your marketing in front of them instead of just putting a flyer in front of them. So we have an entire marketing process of how to use each one of these things. We do not hand this out to the audience. We put these on the table and we put it in the goodie bags. These only get handed out to the audience. They don't go in the goodie bags. They don't go onto the table. So everything has its purpose, its rhyme, its reason, and that's why we have to spend so much time training on this. Is this making sense, everyone? Okay. So that is what's called our personal brand map, and that's included in all of our branding packages because obviously that's the entire marketing system of how we teach. Now, um, one of the cool things um, that we're doing in this particular event, because if you've been to my other events, you know we always do different types of specials, different types of promos, and no, you can't use your digital dollars in conjunction with my special offer, right? Um, if you're interested in potentially doing one of our branding packages, you can speak to uh, Debbie if you're online, and you can speak to Raquel if you're live in the room. What we're gonna do for this event only is we're gonna give you guys a credit towards whichever branding package you wanna do. And we're gonna give you a $5,000 Yes. <laughs> yes. Five thousand dollar credit towards whichever branding package you want. Doesn't matter. Whichever one you feel is best for you. You can have this private conversation with Raquel and Debbie. And I, and I want to do this because I really want to support you guys. And what I ask in return is that you're open to giving me a video testimonial and being a case study. Because as as you notice, for me. And what I teach, it's very important to have clients talk about their experience, right? That's why I had Carl, and that's why I had Brian. It's the same thing, look, would you be open to doing a testimonial video? I want you not only to do this for me, I want you to do it for yourself. I want you to learn from everything that I do, and I want you to copy everything I do. R&D, rip off and do the thing, right? So when you're going to have someone work with you, if you're going to give them some type of discount or credit, do it in exchange, and I like a case study, a testimonial, because now that becomes a marketing asset. So this is the way I look at it. I'm going to give you a $5,000 discount off a brand package and you want it to buy anything. I'm going to get a testimonial and a case study out of it. So I paid $5,000 for brand new marketing. So I don't because some people are like shit. I don't want to. I don't want to give a discount. Consider it an investment in your future marketing because you've got to spend money to market, right? You have to pay someone to do something anyway. 
one's going to do anything for free. We don't even want to do an application for free because we need to honor everybody's time. So my suggestion for you is to copy what I do. Give someone a credit, serve them, give them a benefit so they, they feel the law of reciprocity, right? I want you to know I care, I'm giving you a credit, but I also want you to give back to me. And you're giving back to me in a form that I can utilize that multiple times over to market and to share with the rest of the audience. Is this making sense? Awesome. And in addition to that, last but not least, is, is our own and it's what's we love. Which I want to do a quick video before we go on a break, just to share with you what it's about. Because when you enroll in a branding budget, I want you to realize you're not just building your branding, you're supporting your kids, you're supporting your cause. And I want you to be a part of it as much as you're open to being a part of it, right? You can just say, hey, I'm going to pay my money and do my stuff. I supported, I gave my 10%. Or you can get involved and become a mentor. You can come speak at the events, sponsor a child. That's really what I would love to see from everyone, but worst case scenario, you just enroll in a branding package and you're supporting with the financial contribution of the 10% that I give, not you. I give the 10% of what you pay. Understand that. And I also want you to consider doing the same thing. I want you to consider doing this in your business. I want you to consider, I don't think it's enough. I'm going to consider how can you take, and it doesn't have to be my charity. Right? I, 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 as long as you do this, support a charity, support a nonprofit, and incorporate it into your business. Because you're doing a good thing and you're getting credibility for it. It's a win win, guys. So I encourage you to do that. So I want to share really quickly Influence with Love. This is our nonprofit organization, and it's all about supporting the youth. For me, our future generation is, is what's the most important, right? Our, the kids, the youth, this is why we give a free 360 site to anyone who's 18 or younger. We give, for, it's a dollar a month to be, on, to be exact, so $12 a year, right? Uh, we give uh, 360 sites to any nonprofit organization and to military veterans. So if you guys didn't know that, if you know anyone who's 18 or, or younger and you want to set them up with a 360 site, we have a plan for that. If you know anyone who's a military veteran, uh, we have a plan for that. And anyone who has a nonprofit organization, we give them our pro plan, our $1,500 a year package for a dollar a month. What happens when they turn 19? Then they can upgrade to the basic. <laughs> awesome, good question. All right, so I'm gonna play a quick little video. I hope, hopefully I shared my, uh, my sound. I, I didn't share sound? Darn it. All right, you guys learn from my mistake, okay? When you share screen, always share your sound at the bottom. All right? You gotta always click that little button because you never know when you're gonna have to share a video. Okay. So, screen on three, share. Okay, everybody see it? Yes? Yes. All right, here we go. Hey, my friends, we're in Medellin, Colombia at the orphanage here, and we decided to bring the kids some presents and some treats, and we found out some very crazy news here. These kids here uh, don't have any families or any place to live, so there's 50 kids here looking for homes, and obviously uh, we want to do something very special, so we're going to do something together to help raise some money for these kids that we can build another orphanage because there's so many kids here in need. So uh, we're just here, we're just giving love to the kids. Just want to say hi to them back home in the States. Hola. Hey, my friends, we're in Medellin, Colombia. So this is just one of the orphanages we support. We support all different organizations that have to do with youth and kids. We have another one in Guatemala, we have another one in the Dominican Republic, we have one here in South Miami, like the Homestead area, uh, where the foster, foster children. Um, so we do a lot of different organizations work, and it's really so what I'd love to do is obviously talk to Raquel, talk to Debbie about enrolling her in the branding packages, 
And then after, I'd like to also discuss if you be open to being a mentor, if you'd be open to providing some additional resources and support. When you click support, there's three different ways you can support. Your time, talent, or treasure, okay? And these three different sections talk about it. Your time is volunteer, right? You can help make phone calls. You can uh, um, come support when we actually go out to the different orphanages. You can come on one of the retreats that we do, the missions. Your talent is your services. You might have a resource or a connection um, that we can utilize in an event. Or you might have someone who has a clothing and they can donate clothes to the kids. You might have someone who can provide medical services, right? You might have some type of service that you can donate through your talent. And then treasure is, is, is donating financially, right? And obviously, when you enroll in our branding package, your 10% of, of whatever branding package you uh, enroll in is going to be donated. But you can also donate recurring giving. You can sponsor a child. There's different things that you can do. And I want to encourage you to have a conversation with someone on my team about doing that in the future. Okay? Um, in addition to this, the socially conscious business partnership program that I talked about, that's where you say, you know what? I want to do the same thing you're doing, right? Now, I'm going to work on my brand. I'm going to do my, my videos. I'm going to get out there and make an impact. And I'm open to giving 5 10% of my sales back to a nonprofit. And the Socially Conscious Business Partnership Program is a way for us to support you in creating the marketing collaterals to let your audience know that you're doing this. Because then it becomes a win-win, right? Because then you can have this conversation with your audience as well. And it just creates a ripple effect. And that's what I'm trying to do. I'm just trying to create more socially conscious entrepreneurs in the world that are here about giving back. You want to give her the box? She's got a quick comment. Holly? So for the socially conscious business, it's any type of nonprofit we um, are involved with, or does it go through what you do? So, uh, so to be part of the socially conscious business uh -huh. partnership program, and I don't have time to go over the detail today, but uh, Pastor Daniel will do that with you. It's, it's our program. It would be supporting Influence with Love that supports different organizations. So let's say, for example, you have an orphanage somewhere that you want to support. You'd let Pastor Daniel know our nonprofit could use, uh, pick them as one of our projects to support. But as far as the socially conscious partnership program, it would be you're supporting our nonprofit. Therefore, we have different packages. So let's say you donate $2,000. In that package, you're going to get uh, a social media post. You're going to get a graphic design for your website. You're going to get a little video. Uh, $5,000 sponsorship is going to get you an interview with me on why it's important to be a socially conscious entrepreneur on all my social medias. You get it. So there's different packages. So instead of just donating to a nonprofit and getting the thank you letter, you're donating and getting marketing content that you can use. And, and Obviously, this made sense for me because it's a business I'm in, right? Like, I do this already, so I could interview you about the book, but I could also interview you about being a socially conscious entrepreneur, and guess what? Now the whole world sees your interview, and we put, and it's a win-win, right? So you guys get how this all came about, right? So uh, Pastor Daniel, we'll, we'll, it's Daniel is. is. Daniel I-S. If we can drop that in the chat, Nicole. Dan, oh, here, actually, I'll do it. I'll, I'll pull him up so you guys can see him. And this is the cool thing about a 360, right? Like any other nonprofit could talk about their executive director and couldn't pull him up in 10 seconds, right? They couldn't do that. This is, this is the power in action of what I've been teaching for three days. Oh, let me introduce you to Daniel. 10 seconds later, there's Daniel. Daniel, I is 360, and I'll take it and drop it inside the chat for everyone that's in the chat. If you're not in the chat, DanielIS360.com. Oh, Nicole beat me to it. Thank you, Nicole. And you know what? Let's see here. Let's let's do something. Let's take 60 seconds to meet Daniel. Hi, my name is Daniel Isaiah Shalak, and I'm known as the Christpreneur. My team and I empower faith-based entrepreneurs to reach their God-given potential in both life and business. We develop proven strategies over 15 years to break strongholds spiritually, physically, financially, and professionally. What I love best about what I do is seeing my brothers and sisters make an impact for our Father's kingdom. Whenever I'm not working, 
I love to spend time with my beautiful wife, Shasta, and go on daddy-daughter dates with my baby girl, Emily Rose. I also cook like a chef, and I love making my own fresh roasted coffee. The best way to reach me is by visiting my personal website, danuis360.com. Less than 60 seconds, now we know who he is. Isn't that cool? Is, you see how everything I'm saying to you, I can actually demonstrate and I use it every single day. This is what I want for you. I want you to be able to have a client say, I want to introduce you to Jessica. Watch this 60 second video. Oh my God, not only is she beautiful, she's a badass too, right? right? That's, what, that's the power I want you to have. So we're, we're gonna take, let me see, hold on a second. We're gonna take a break. Um, I'm going to give you guys an opportunity. If you have any questions online about any of our branding packages, talk to Debbie. Uh, she'll take care of you guys. If you're in the room, talk to Raquel. We're going to take a 15 minute break and it's freezing me here, by the way. I don't know if I just took my jacket off. This, I think I need one of those blankets now. It's so cold in here. Um, uh, let's see. It is, it is 12.05. So I'll see you back at 12.20 PM Eastern, right back in the room, 15 minute break. Let's get that countdown timer up, Nicole. I'll see everybody back at 1220. It's really, really amazing. But uh, boys are, are just absolutely amazing. So you guys told me it was the VIP branding experience. And it really was the VIP. You get picked up at the airport. It's fancy. Uh, uh,